He is your savior. You're confident in yourself. You can like show them that love because you might not know what they're gonna go through. Me, I'm gonna treat them nice because God, God in the Bible tell me it's good to do it. Today, I will be reading um, the Bible of Mark and Luke. Mark and Luke. greater than these right, so I'm going, um, I'm going to give you my reason why you should love your neighbors as you love yourself so basically like if your neighbors like um they don't feel they don't feel like they love themselves or they don't feel confident in yourself you can like show them that love because you might not know what they're gonna go through and you can just show them that love that they're going like if they're having a hard time in life, you can like just always like give them hugs, um, tell them it's okay, or you're gonna go, you're gonna get through this. And yeah, like just they, just give them the love that you got, like the same love that you love yourself. So you should, you should always be yourself. Like if your neighbor is not feeling confident in yourself, you can show them that love back to them. So that is why you should always. Love your neighbors as you love yourself. You can, you can make them feel that genuine love, that you love them. Like if other people are not loving them, you can feel that love. They can feel that love, that genuine love that you give them. No, it's, a, it's okay. It's okay. You're like, the other person was saying like they love you, but you don't really feel that love. It's like, it's just evil love. You don't really feel that. But then genuine love is like, you get that natural love from somebody. When they tell you that they love you, you just feel Good morning, kids. Can everyone please turn to Mark 12, verse 31, please? Alright, kids, today we're going to wrap up on Luke 6, verse 31. Please turn to Luke 6, verse 31. Alright class, this lesson helps you understand how to love your neighbors and how to treat others how you want to be treated. Okay, so the second chapter we're going to be reading today is Luke 6, um, verse 29. Do to others as you would have them do to you. So basically, how to, basically to treat others how you want to be treated. So like... That you should do it because basically, because just God said to do it. And it's in the Bible. So you should even do it anyways. I'm going to give you my reason why. So, 
First we have the positive. I'm gonna give you the positive way. The person can just like give you like so the positive way is like the person like next thing the person will be homeless. You'll be real mean to them and real 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 mean to them. And the next and then the next day they'll be like super famous and they'll get a lot of money and then you will be there and then you'll be like losing money, you're in a bad situation right now. And they'll try to help you out. So like like yeah like so you don't understand why that's the positive way and then you got the negative way the negative way is like if still like if the person if you the person is like homeless they're being real real rude to you next day they'll be they'll be like rich rich real rich and just really rich and you um will like be real losing stuff and things and the next day they um you try to ask you see the same type of person you try to ask them for money you let them no you've been rude to me my whole entire life why would I give you anything and that's the po that's the negative way you never know if you're gonna end up in the positive scenario or the negative scenario so you should always treat others how you want to be treated so so um I, my siblings are about to come in and um they're gonna give you a reason why but I just said like a reason why. And and if they get if they do the reason good, they'll get a cookie. So I'm about to go wash my hands and we'll be right back. Alright guys, so my sister's going and while she's doing that, I'm gonna make the cookies and we're gonna listen. If you treat somebody bad, you going if if you treat somebody bad, the other person is gonna treat your bad. So but me, I'm gonna treat them nice because God God in the Bible tell me. And that's actually in, um, actually I'm going to catch up with my Bible because that's actually like something that's in the Bible. So we're going to like redo um, Luke and let's see what do Luke. So, do to others as you would have them do to you. If you love those who love you, what credit is that to you? Even sinners love those and love those who love them. And if you do good to those who are good to you, what credit is that to you? Even sinners do that. And if you lead to those from whom you expect repayment, that credit is that to you. Even sinners led to sinners expecting to be repaid in full. But love your enemy, do good to them and lead them without expecting to get anything back, then then your your reward will be great and you will you will be ch ch your ch you you will be ch children reward to children of the most high because he is kind to he is kind to the ungrateful and he's wicked be merciful just as your father is merciful. So like, yeah. And yeah, as it says right here, but love your enemies, do good to them. Just like she, the, just like she said when she was explaining too. And yeah, just be good to your enemies and just treat, just treat them good. Just be good to your enemies. All right, and I made her cook. So let's hear, try it. <laughs> you like it? All right. So like, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> thank you. All right. So we're about to get that our next sibling, in and we'll be Marcy. So let let's let him come. All right, guys. So we have Marcy, and let let's let him. Sit. Okay, so my reason is it's going to help me be a better person and uh, make other people be a better, per a better person and spread positivity around the world. And that's all. I'm going to lead by a good example. All right. That was good, and you get your. Thank you. You're welcome. 
<laughs> Come on, share your cookie. Yeah. It's good? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Alright. Larry, we're about to get Lonnie and he's about to say his. Let's let them talk and I will make the cookie too. Alright, no, it's me. Can be a form of bullying. You can make somebody not want to love their self, not want to be in this world. You never know their problem. So you just want to uh, not mess with people, uh, not judge people. Don't, just, you need to learn how to not bully or a form of bullying. And that's all I gotta say. You gotta say something, Betty? She, she going to sleep right now, YouTube. So you want to make sure you treat people how you want to be treated because you don't know what they're going through. All right, and that was good. And here, you get your cookie. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm. <laughs> all right, and that's all. And let's just talk about and yeah. Oh, you two. Betty got a piece. Mm mm mm. Bye bye, Betty. <laughs> All right, that's it, guys. All right, you two. So I'm about to um wrap the video up and make my cookie so I can see what it tries like what it tastes like because they I, they said it tastes good so I'm gonna try too. Oh. Alright, I'm about to try the cookie, see what it tastes like. That actually so good. Yeah. Yeah, that cookie is good. They were right, but anyways, I'm about to wrap the oh, let me stop. Alright. Always remember to love others like you love yourself and treat others how you want to be treated and make and make sure to comment like subscribe and um we're, what look out for more of these videos and yeah just look out for more of these videos and we'll be posting more soon and just yeah all right youtube i'm about to wrap up the video bye we love you and that's all bye youtube even when you feel low, you can still go Even when you feel slow, you can still go Even when there's no hope, you can still go I never ran to the no man, I still go Go, go